and off those robots go. In this batch, interestingly, all six teams elected to preload cones on board their robots. Blue Alliance able to score all three in the upper rung for a collective 18 points. Blue Alliance able to score two on the upper nodes for 12 points, as well as one in the middle for 16 total. Coming out of the autonomous period, our two alliances virtually in the same boat, 41 to 37. Now with drivers in control, Team Rush in their community, but bad news for the Blue Alliance. Control Z, their arm up high, just a little too much, and tips them over. That right there, a hard hit from Golden Bots sends them tumbling. Our Blue Alliance now down to just State Line Robotics and Team Rush. They'll need to work hard to close the gap and stay in the lead at this match. Argos placing a cone on an upper node and then flying out of the Red Alliance community. Metal Cow Robotics filling their place with a cone of their own. Metal Cow sticking to driving over the charge station to get in and out of the community. Control Z looks like they may be trying to right themselves. They're using some creative physical thinking to see if their arm could push their robot back up. They are in a better position and there they go! Control Z back on the ground, but flying in a circle. Control Z now stuck on Golden Bots. Impressive how they're able to get back on their feet, but their swerve modules at full speed. Control Z is stuck inside of Golden Bots, but now free. Golden Bots, however, midfield not moving. There are blinking lights on board their robot. They have power, but their drive team not in control. Despite all the craziness midfield, our two alliances are tied. 92 points apiece with 20 seconds remaining in the match. Stateline Robotics and Team Rush docked and engaged for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance hoping to have two robots do the same. Argos, Metal Cow docked and engaged for Red. Both alliances earning 20 points from their charge station in the end game period. Score 131 to 114. However, during that match, a red card was assessed against Team 4096 Control Z for violation of rule G205, causing damaging contact within an opposing robot.